So we built some mittens, mittens and kittens, all kinds of different mittens, the kind of mittens that you get from your grandma, right? Where you have a string that kind of goes between the two different mittens. So if you have one that drops off, it's attached to the other. Also, a lot of parents will take this string that goes across the mittens and tie it into your, to your uh, snowsuit so that you can, whenever your gloves come off, that they don't get lost. You know, I don't know how many gloves I uh, lost as a kid, but I know it, it was many. And you don't find it until all the snow goes away in the next season. So um, there we go. So we got some mittens. If you guys want to play long and build your own mittens, go check out the link down below. There's an affiliate link where you can go and pick up the kit that we use. It's only 201, 221 pieces. You can pick it up at Walmart, Amazon. The link down below is to an Amazon affiliate link. And it typically runs about $15. So it doesn't take a lot to be able to build an endless supply of objects utilizing Legos. So we have, we're, I think we're over 100 episodes already of objects that we've built out of just this one kit. So, I mean, it's an endless supply of fun. Love for you guys to play along with us each and every day. Okay, don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. And uh, you'll get notifications when we come out with a new video each and every day. Thanks, everybody. Let's go check out how I built this in under two minutes of time. Or under almost three, but officially under five minutes of time. Let's go check it out. So what we're we gonna build today, it's mittens. You guys know what mittens are? Let's go put five minutes on the clock and we'll show you. So mittens are those gloves that don't have fingers, right? They're the, the fingers the, are all joined together. You got a thumb on mittens, but that's it. Typically they're made by um, grandmothers that like to knit mittens. Um, there's books like Mittens and Kittens. There's lots of, th um, Lots of things that uh, are associated with mittens, but we're going to go build some. And that's going to be really difficult, I think. Uh, let's see what we can do. So I'm pulling some mittens and kittens together here. I want to be somewhat symmetrical. Ooh, 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 ooh. Maybe it's going to be just like this. Is it something like this? Ooh, that looks fairly decent. Um, yeah. Yeah, mittens, right? I don't know if you see it yet. That looks really close. We can use this purple here so that you get the thumb. Oh, that's perfect. That's perfect. Let's see here. We need something underneath it to support it. A oh, white. Use the white here. And white over on this side. We need another piece to support that. And I think we have threes. Yeah. Three by two. Plates, brown, three by two plate brown. Mittens and kittens. Are we done? I think we're done. We're close to being done. I'd like to add some like frilly, frilly stuff to it. You know, something that a grandmother would add, you know, something like, something like that. And there's normally like a string that goes between each other or between your mitten and your coat. Right? There's like a string. Can I do something like that? Um, wonder, 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 wonder. I'm gonna try and try to change this just a little bit. Bear with me. Let's see how that looks. I think that looks better. So we're going to do that. Oops. Didn't go down far enough. Yep. 
Them like that. Mittens are tied together like that. Come on now. Or maybe it's uh maybe it's something like this. I'm gonna do one of these here. Mittens, I think that looks fantastic. So you got a little string here in between the two sets of mittens. I think that looks awesome. I'm, do I have it reversed? Oh no, do I have it reversed? Do I have this reversed? Am I wrong? Should I do this? Ooh, is this looking to look better? Yep, mittens and kittens. So you got a little embellishment over on this side. You got the thumbs sticking out like this. Uh, you got the string that joins to them together. You know, for some reason that all the kid mittens that I remember have that. So we have ourselves some mittens. I think it looked, I think it turned out really good. This is, this one I'm excited about because I think it looks dead on with what you would expect when it comes to mittens, right? I mean, maybe some more embellishments, maybe something like this uh, on the side here. Yeah, something like that. That looks like mittens to me. Leave a comment down below if you think this turned out really good. If you think that there was another way of doing it with the current set that we have, the 229 pieces, you know, leave a comment down below. Love to hear your constructive criticism and how we can make our videos better. Also, if you go out and build your own Lego mittens, leave it in our social medias. I'd love to see a picture of anything that you build. Just hashtag MakeShareDaily or take a look at the links down below and uh, to our social media accounts. Thanks everybody for watching and let's now go check out what we're going to build tomorrow. Cool. So mittens, that was a cool build. Let's go spin the wheel and find out what we're gonna build tomorrow. So January is a cold month. We have nothing but snow, ice, and winter sports on the board. So what we got here? Ice fishing, the sport of ice fishing. It's not really a sport when you live in a cabin on top of ice. Um, but let's go try to build a, ice, maybe it's ice fisher. Maybe it's the ice with a string through it with, with catching a fish. Could be a bunch of things that we build out of Legos to, that match ice fishing. So check it out tomorrow, 7 a.m. And go ahead, check out our giveaway video where we're giving away uh, all sorts of different Legos, including a Lego X-Wing. So go check out that video to find out how you can enter to win. Okay, thanks everybody for watching. We'll see you tomorrow. Make sure you to play along. Okay, bye-bye.